What's up guys, my name is Cobbs and welcome back to my GT7 playthrough. We're going to be continuing with the cafe. We made a lot of credits because I've done that championship so many times and to, just to get the right tune, the last championship that we did. Uh, but our upcoming collection is the AMG collection. Uh, I don't really know much about Mercedes and AM AMG, but I think the SLS is, is a good one. Um, but yeah, so we got the AMG C63 2015, the SLS AMG. And we got the GTS. Okay, let's start this. For this menu, I'd like you to collect some models from the German brand AMG. AMG is the high performance subsidiary of Mercedes Benz AG. Mercedes cars may be associated with luxury, but they are also high performing competitive vehicles. Collect three and come back here and see me. I'll be waiting. Okay, so it's just any German cars, right? So I think the Nurburg, I think this is the best one, maybe? No, nah, I think I should use my M3. Straight up, let's just use the M3, the bad boy, the beautiful. You know what, maybe we should just get nitrous because it is a need for speed most wanted car. Why didn't we even get nitrous when we when we first built this car? We should have got it, I think. The nitrous, of course. Let's go. <laughs> All right, 100K for the nitrous. It is quite expensive, but you know, it's, it's fun. It's nice to have, it's fun to drive with. Maybe we should do the Nürburgring race so that we can win. I think the best car is in the Nürburgring race, isn't it? Isn't that the best one? I think so, maybe. All right, let's just do the, the Nürburgring with our M3. It's almost 700 PP, so it's good to go. All right, let's do it. Nürburgring Nordschleife. Might need to move my camera so I can show you guys the map as well because you guys never see the map when it's always hidden. Surely they should make the best one on the Notch Life, right? All right, come on, M3. Oh, yeah. All right, ah, shit. Nitros. Save us, Nitros. Nitros. Yes. Oh, shit. Oh no! What am I doing? Let me turn off traction control because I really don't want it. Is that an M3? I think so. I think it's a 2007 M3. Oh my god. We almost spun out there. That would have been very bad. Gotta be really careful. Oh god. Oh my- Ayo! Nah, 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 nah. Why are you hitting me? Bruh, that's ridiculous. Alright, maybe we should just put it on one, the traction control. On the carousel. Shit. Alright, we're good. Nice. Come on, on the straight. Surely we can overtake first. It's only one lap, of course. Here we go. On the straight. Use the nitrous. Yes, M3 is king. The M3. With the nitrous. Let's see what we can go to the max. What's the max? Come on. Nitrous. All the way. <laughs> oh my god. What is the max? I, I really don't even know what is the max in this car. I haven't really tested it. Uh, I don't think we can reach the max here. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Nice. Alright, we did it. M3 done it pretty comfortably, I feel like. Solid. We were all the way at the back and we came first. 64,000 credits and we earn the SLR, I think. SLS actually. I think the SLS is the best one, isn't it? I don't even know, but I feel like this one is pretty cool as well. Here it is. SLS, AMG. I mean, it's, it's alright. It's kind of cool, maybe sort of it's quite a heavy car as well so i don't know if i like heavy cars anymore because i like to corner very easily so with a lighter car it's a lot better all right we might need to restrict the power a little bit racing brakes all right you know what let's get weight reductions we'll go for the weight reductions early on 1300 is not bad i think but if we do that then that will be really light 1200 that's pretty pretty good all right let's restrict the horsepower maybe we'll do it all the way just to see how low it goes 676 balance tuning pushes it the most i think pushes it up quite a bit we can get the racing racing silencer uh 
Okay, we'll get that. We'll get the air filter. Wait, there's no turbo? I forgot about the top. Oh my god, there's a super... Supercharge. That is the biggest horsepower upgrade. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me get rid of some of the things that we put on. We get rid of the... This, and this, and this. I totally forgot about the supercharge. <laughs> And the turbo. Oh my god, it's 707 now. All right, well, let's get it. We can increase the weight, I guess. So it's going to be like 1,300 kg, which is not bad. It's all right, I guess. I mean, we have 509 horsepower now. Once you upgrade the visual customization, I think it also affects the PP. So let's get a wide body. All right, let's get custom parts. We got the front. Okay, we'll get that. That's pretty cool. The side, there's only one, so we'll get that. Why not? And the back solid oh my 725 now this rear thingy apparently raises the pp a lot for some reason okay maybe we will not use the back one because for some reason it raises the pp a lot that only raises it a little bit unfortunately we can't use it maybe it just it like affects the aerodynamics or something i don't even know reduce the weight right under 700 pp and now it, it weighs 1336 not bad i guess i don't know what the car was originally i think it was like 1000 i think it was a lot heavy actually i think it was like 1500 originally but yeah let's do this new circuit it's the one in spain in barcelona let's go it's actually quite cool I guess. All right, let's see how she performs. Solid. So that's the SLR. Yeah, I think the SLS looks cooler. So I'm not really the biggest fan of Mercedes, but I think the SLS is a very popular choice. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, like which one is the most popular one in Mercedes? Okay, maybe just one traction control because it does help at, uh, It does help with, with not spinning out. All right, but we're first now. Just need to do like, what, three more laps? All right, there we go. We've done it. 88,000 credits, damn. Three-star roulette ticket. And we got our reward car, which is the AMG GTS. Okay, cool. But this one is pretty cool. I think this one might be one of the cooler ones. We've got to do this on the St. Croix. All right, I think one traction control is good because it has like some control. So you can spin out less, but it's also like not limiting you too much. It's like the least amount of assistance. So you don't spin out. I think this SLS is, can easily destroy everyone in this race. <laughs> Uh, it, because it, it seems like it's a very good tune right now. Seems like it's a lot faster than everyone else, apparently. Because I am easily beating everyone. Like, I am easily catching up to everyone and, like, overtaking them and stuff, you know? Alright, we're in the top three now. Just need to beat the Brazilian and the Hungarian. That's Hungary, right? Hungary, I mean. It's actually quite a base, this SLS. I think in this view, I drive the best, usually. This is actually a really nice car to drive. Oh, it has seven gears? No way. Damn. I was not expecting this car to have seven. All right, there we go. We've done it. We've finished all three races pretty easily because this SLS was just amazing. This tune was just simply better than everyone. And we got the AMG C63. Uh, I feel like it's just so big, though. Like, it's just a massive car you know yeah maybe the sls is the coolest one let me know in the comments which one which mercedes do you guys think is the best mercedes because i really don't know much about mercedes and i don't really like mercedes too much <laughs> but yeah anyway but this sls is really nice so maybe i i kind of like the sls now we will see what luca has to say about mercedes AMG completed. Congrats, you've got all three cars. This completes your AMG collection. Once you've collected your rewards, I've got some stories to tell you about these cars. Four star roulette ticket. Okay. When you hear the name AMG, you probably think of super fast cars, right? Mm, not really. Indeed, th those three letters have become synonymous with Mercedes high performance models. The AMG brand was formed in 1967 by two former Mercedes race engineers, Hans Werner at Ofrecht and Erhard Melker. It started out as a tuning factory dealing with Mercedes race engines. One of their most famous projects was a bright red racing car into which they placed a rather special engine. Okay, this car is apparently a legend car that we can buy. I don't know if we can still buy it now, but it's uh, it's quite cool, I guess. <laughs> Why does it have so many headlights? That's what I want to know, <laughs> but it's quite cool. I don't know. It's very interesting, this, this car. The Mercedes-Benz AMG 300 SEL 6.8 liter. What? 
The base model is the 300 SEL 6.3 with 226.8 horsepower, but it was tuned to produce nearly double the output at 394.5. The car took an impressive second place at the Spa 24 hours in 1971. And the company started to develop a huge following as a Mercedes-Benz related racing brand. In 1999, the company actually became part of Mercedes-Benz and continued to produce high performance models today. Wait, so AMG was like a brand by itself, I guess? Okay, well the next one is a Nissan GTR collection and you know I love me some GTRs, okay. Yeah, I'm happy that I chose the SLS to customize because I think the SLS is probably the coolest one, but I'm not sure. All right, let's open this roulette ticket and then we will end the video off. Come on, four star. Oh, it's all cars and they're all racing cars as well. Oh my God. Yo, which one? Jaguar? Damn. Solid. Jaguar F-Type Group 3. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new. And make sure to hit the notification bell down below to stay notified when I upload. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.